There go my dog, Miss Bright Eyes. She's got a little bit bigger. She's been doing kind of okay when it comes to people, but Miss Bright Eyes is kind of timid a little bit. She's kind of timid. The cold part about Miss Bright Eyes is I, I had her her whole life, ever since she was a baby puppy. But she has this timidness about her. I've had dogs like that before, too. That, you know, their trust level is just not there. You know? And it's been kind of hard with me and Miss Bright Eyes. She's sitting over there right now with the teacup chihuahua. You know, everybody always... uh giving a bully a bad name or something like that. Man, what you see is what you get when you deal with the American bully. And this particular bully right here, Miss Bright Eyes, she got a little bit more pit bull off in her than bully. You know? she Bright Eyes. You can see it in her face. Her face is kind of longer. Just a tad bit. She don't have that brachiocephalic nose. And it's not white. It's red. She got nice almond shaped eyes. Beautiful eyes. Beautiful body. She loves me. She loves me. She loves my little dog. You know what I mean? Bright eyes. Right now it's very cold outside. You know what I mean? As you know, we can see. It's a cold night, man. It's a very cold night. It's winter time. Just came in. You know, what's today's date? I think it's the 18th. Nice and cold outside. Right now, I'm left at the house by myself. You know, and, uh, I'm just chilling, man. You know what I mean? Having a nice night to myself right now. Bright eyes. We're talking about you. She don't want to look at the camera. She hates the camera. You know what I mean? You got a lot of hateful and mean people in this world when it comes to dogs. They need to set their eyes on some real dogs that don't like to bite people. You know? Now, I know Miss Bright Eyes is a puppy. But this is this this my first puppy faced the bully and showed you right, because Miss Nunu, she didn't bite nobody either. You know, you know we got dogs that don't bite. Now I know there's some bullies out there that might bite, but let me tell all you people out there, some of you hateful motherfuckers out there, some of those dogs are crossbred dogs. It don't matter to a person that don't like dogs, though. Mm -mm. A person that don't, that don't like dogs, that person will say that uh, any any bull faced bull breed dog is a hitter. Look at her; she looks she looks nice. Looks like venom. You know what I mean? Look just like venom. She gonna be bigger than venom, though. And she looked just like Venom. They'll say any bull breed dog is a killer. Look how big she's got. You can look on there and see she's got big. She's got a little bigger. I like that dog. I like all dogs, you know what I'm saying? I just I think you could take any dog and make some of it. You know what I mean? Bright Eyes is a one person's dog though. You know, she she look at she look at her. She just beautiful. You know what I'm saying? When <laughs> when when bright eyes is around, it's just about us. You know. Look at her face. Edge ain't dead. You know what I mean? Edge ain't dead. No, it's just some of y'all don't like Edge. And it's good. We, we we approve of it. You know what I mean? Uh, a lot of people that got American bullies, they approve of it. If you like the bulldog, look, go for it. You know? There's a lot of mean-ass people that, 
that'll try to say, you can't bring these kind of dogs in public. Man, look, these dogs stay in public. They live in public. You just be, if you don't like the American bully dog, a, night, a person that's trying to breed a nice dog that don't bite, then you just don't like no dogs. And you, if you don't like no dogs, then it don't matter what the dog is. You're going to talk about it, right? First, it's the bull breed dog. We'll start off by saying it's just the bull breed dogs. But that's a lie. You, you really don't like no dogs at all. So if you don't like no dogs at all, it's not the bull breed dog. It's every single dog. Just tell the truth. It's every single dog. You know what I'm saying? Because ain't no bull breed dog. Every single bull breed dog is not violent. Every single bull breed dog is not a violent dog that just don't like to run out and bite people and eat people up. But, you know, you have people that say they will. You have people that think that rain... Is all they need to protect their homes. My dog, right now, y'all probably think she got fleas. People who don't like dog will probably say, she got fleas. She don't got no fleas. She don't got no, no fleas. But I'm looking at her and I'm thinking that her skin might be itching because of the bath that she took. So I could probably take, probably... Sometimes I've even used fish oil to rub on her skin. You know what I'm saying? But I usually rub coconut oil on it. Nah, she don't got no fleas. You know what I'm saying? So you got to show shit like this because people will say crazy things, man. Cray cray things, man. They'll, show, they'll say crazy things. Mm -mm. You scratch your uh, behind sometime and you ain't got no fleas and... And, and mites and shit on you, but it's, it's cool for you to, to scratch your behind, but it's not cool for her to scratch hers. She can scratch her behind. One thing I don't like to hear people trying to do on the under is attack the American bully. Don't do that, because the American bully don't bite people. Bull-faced dogs, they might be out there biting people, but that's a crossbreed-ass dog. When you get a crossbred dog that bites something, I think it should be kind of like a catch-22 and illegal for you to take that crossbred dog and make him a part of a breed. See, this is a breed. That's the bully, American bully. It has pit bull in there. It's got some staffy in there. You know what I'm saying? Got some, uh, I heard a guy the other day say they got American Bulldog in there. He a damn lie. He a damn lie. But I ain't gonna, I, I'm not name dropping. I'm not name dropping. But that's a lie. I mean, there are some American bullies that have Bulldogs in them. But the American bully, don't. it shouldn't have American Bulldog in it. Now, if that's the way you bred it, that's your shit. That's the way you bred it. But don't sit here and tell these people that you can go and breed an American bulldog to an American bully. That's a lie. Don't sit here and tell people that this dog has bulldog in it. Some of them do. Some of them do. But they're not supposed to, even though them extremes is being bred with bulldog in them. You can't tell me they're not. Even though them extremes is being bred with bulldog in them, you can't tell me they're not. They they short. They got longer backs. Their noses is pointed up to the sky. They got round eyes. They don't even have almond-shaped eyes. They got round eyes. And some of them got bad hawks. Pay attention to their hawks. They look like their elbows have been punched on or something, like somebody been socking them in the elbow and their elbows just swole up. Real facts. I'm not talking about them dogs, okay? But we do have a right as people who like the American bully dog, you know what I'm saying, to speak on, on, on the way you breed these damn dogs. I'm not talking about it saying it's ugly. You can talk about that bitch and say it's ugly. Like I always do around this time. Welcome to another episode of Face the Bully.
where I do talk about dogs, preferably your dog and mine, okay? So I'm not talking about nobody's dog. You know, my, my dog acting lazy right now, but like I just showed you, it is nighttime. So, you know what I mean? She can go to sleep and chill out. She been outside all day. That's a real dog. She goes out and play. I have to go catch her. You know what I mean? Some people don't have to go catch their dogs. I have to go catch this one. She's a puppy. She active as hell. She active as hell. Look how, look how when they go to sleep, they just fall out when they active like that. Bright eyes. Bright eyes. She is really sleeping too. She is really sleeping. And all these dogs are not the kind of dogs that go outside and bite people. She listening to me. I can see her ears up. She listening to me. But nah, these aren't. Every single American bully don't go outside and bite nobody. They don't. Why y'all want to come up with these channels and, and, and make people believe that every single American bully goes outside to eat people up? Bright Eyes is going to die if she goes out and attempts to bite somebody. And that's just off gas, off the dribble. That's off the dribble. She's, she's getting put down instantly. Instantly. Because inside of the American bully world, people don't breed aggressive dogs. Although we breed terrier dogs, and the terrier dogs might start to take on their lineage. You know, sometimes you might get a puppy outside... In one of those litters, that might be a little bit more aggressive. Okay, that's okay. He's just showing his true genetics. He's just showing his true character, his true breed. Why are you worried about that dog? Now, if you see dogs on the street, they're running around. They bite somebody. Hey, you put that dog down. You see dogs on the street, and they're running around, and they didn't bite nobody, but it's a bull breed dog. Try to help the dog. Try to help the dog get, I mean, if you got some place in your backyard, take him home, feed him, water him, and see if you can find him a nice home. Don't run to the YouTube and go make a channel and say, look at this damn dog. He's going to kill somebody out here. He ain't going to kill nobody. He's not going to kill nobody. You know, sometimes you need to make the video of the dog killing the person instead of just sitting there saying that the dog is killing the person. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? <laughs> Make the damn video show the dog killing somebody. I know this video right here is crazy because my dog will not get up and she won't show you how she usually get down. But right now it's dark time and I don't blame her shit. You know what I mean? My teacup chihuahua, she might want to play with you. Look at her. Uh, she's my teacup. There she go. With her little small self. There go my other dog. Now when Bella... Goes by my dog. I bet you people will be like, oh, man, that little bitty dog finna get ate up. It's not going to get ate up. All all bullies are not animal aggressive. Some of them are. Hey, man, you're going to get 12 dogs in a litter. You think all 12 dogs are going to act the same? No. So stop making a stigma on the American bully and really stop talking on the American bully. If you don't own an American bully and you don't know nothing about no American bully, stop talking about a bully. You don't even own a fucking bully. I mean, if you own a bully and your bully is just crazy and dumb like that, then get that damn dog to the ASPCA and let him spay, neuter him, or put him down. See, you don't even need to be breeding dogs if you're not planning on keeping that dog. You don't need to be breeding them, you know, if you're not going to sit there and make sure that that dog is going to be taken care of and not go out in the street and bite people because sometimes you got dogs like my dog right here. That will be in the yard all day, but run up and down the gate, barking and barking and barking and barking at dogs and people that are walking dogs by my gate all day. You know, when you when you got a dog that constantly does that every day, shit, eventually they might get it into their head that they just don't like other dogs. <laughs> because all day long, and this ain't no lie, I wish there was some light outside. I show you, and she could run up and down the gate all day long, man. You know what I mean? And and you know what I'm saying? It's just like it's a, it's a gate right there. You know, she runs up and down that gate. She could go all the way down the backyard down there. You know, it's a long ass backyard down there. You know what I'm saying? She could she can she can move. 
You know what I'm saying? These dogs move, man. You know, we have dogs that do that. That that run run around. You know what I mean? Dogs do that. Now y'all sit here and say that they're crazy and man, my dog ain't crazy, man. Ain't nothing wrong with my dog. Her daddy is a beast. You should see him. Her daddy is a beast. He big as hell. But he ain't crazy as hell. He ain't crazy, man. Gotta stop putting a bad stigma on the American bully. These dogs are nice. When you take a dog and you crossbreed them, and you don't know what the fuck that dog is. You know what I'm saying? And but you know, but you can see it in the face that he a pit bull. He got some pit in him. But you don't know what he is? Man, trust me, you don't even know how that motherfucking dog gonna act, and you'd be better off giving his ass away. You know, give him away, man. Give him away. Spade, neuter him, or put him down. Now, let me tell you something about that put-down shit. I'm not into putting no dogs down unless they're sick and getting ready to die. If he gotta get ready to die, you know, he getting ready to die, then you know what I'm saying? Like them old cowboys used to do, take out the old shotgun and shoot him in the head. Hey, that's what the cowboys used to do. Don't blame me. They take the shotgun out and shoot him in the head. Bah! <laughs> I'm just fucking with you. <laughs> they probably think this nigga is tripping. <laughs> nah, I'm just playing. <laughs> I'm just playing, though. Real feisty bully, man. Uh, but every single dog, man, is not a killer. Trust me. Every single dog is not a killer. You might have some dogs that are violent, but they're not killers. Miss Bright Eyes ain't no killer. Miss Bright Eyes, she don't want to fuck with you right now. She really like, dude, go, on, go to hell. It's not good right now. <laughs> you know what I mean? I'll be seeing people, man, and they have dogs that look like American bullies, but they ain't American bullies. You know, they didn't, you could tell that they didn't crossbred this dog to some bulldog or something. And then he go on the street and he start, you know, some of them don't act crazy. The majority of them don't act crazy. But you might have one or two of them that might want to bark and go crazy. And I guarantee you, if he started chasing you, he'd probably, you know, put up 10 steps at least. And then he stop. If bright eyes start chasing you, she going to chase you until she catch you. That's a fact. But... A lot of these dogs, especially the dogs with the short tails, nah, they're not going to chase you, man, and try to kill you and shit like that. He ain't got no, he ain't got no win. He ain't got no win to, to, ch to chase you like that. American bullies are nice dogs anyway. They just don't want to chase your ass. But then you got dogs like this one. You know what I'm saying? My, my dog, she got that drive in her. And as time goes by, I'm going to keep that camera on her and I'm going to keep showing you. She, you know, she just a, she's a, a, a whole bully right here. I just got to say it. She just a whole bully. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> she just got bully all through her. You know what I mean? Back in the day type shit, man. You can look at her and see she, she just goes, you know. Um, me, myself, personally, because I was talking to Greco Bully Camp the other day. Greco said <clears throat> he don't like a leggy dog. Really, I don't like a leggy dog. I don't. I don't like a leggy dog either. I like a short, short dog. You know, I like a, a stout dog, boxed head dog. I do like that. I don't want the dog to look like a uh, fucking bulldog. But, you know, I do like a shorter dog. I would love, I, I would like for all bright eyes puppies to come out taller, but, I mean shorter, but... Me, me knowing where Bright Eyes came from, me seeing it, the mama and the daddy, nah, I wanted to keep, I wanted to stay like she is. Because when she get bigger, she'll be nice, she'll be nice size. You know, she won't look like no XL. She ain't got no master in her. Bright Eyes, Bright Eyes. She don't fuck with you when she laying down, though. She do not. She, <laughs> she don't fuck with you when she laying down. She like to just chill out. She like listening to these channels where people be talking about we we want to kill dogs and dogs shouldn't be around other people and coming into functions and shit like that, man. Fuck what you talking about, homie. 
You know what I'm saying? We know our dogs. Our dogs are like family, bro. If we bring, if we want to bring our dog to the function, trust me, that dog ain't finna bite nobody. That dog done been to many functions. And even when it's not at a function, it ain't functioning to bite nobody. God, man, fucking channels, man, where people be talking about dogs ain't shit. But they are. I understand why you would want to say a dog ain't shit. Like, we only want this motherfucker for money. This bitch right here is not probably going to give me a lot of money. And I ain't even looking for no money from Bright Eyes. She's probably not going to give me a lot of money. This ain't about money. It's about bully shit. Because we told you it was about money. The very first thing you do is say, oh my gosh. And that's what they do. Just breed them motherfucking dogs so they can have a gang of money. <laughs> God dang, bruh. We can't win for losing with a motherfucker, man. You know what I'm saying? You just can't win for losing. So, no, we don't breed for money. We breed to better the dogs. Now, if you want an exotic, you can breed that shit, too. You know what I mean? But we don't breed exotics. And I did hear Greco say he liked the short, the, the dogs that's not leggy, the shorter dog. Yeah, I like them, too, man. I like them, too. I'm not going to lie. I like those, but most Edge dogs, because I'm a fucking Razor's Edge fan. I am. That's one dog that I'm a fan of, because that was the first dog I ever had, was a Razor's Edge. You know what I'm saying? When it came to the bullies, and I stopped having pit bulls, the first dog I ever had was an Edge dog. So I'm a fan of the Edge dog. I've seen many different Edge dogs. I'm a fan of that dog. But I am a fan of that short, stout, stocky motherfucker, too, though. But I'm not a fan. Let me see what I'm not a fan of. I'm not a fan of, of the bloodline, of any bloodline that carries a high rear. I'm not a fan of that. I don't like high rears. Bright eyes. I, I really want my dog to stand up right now. I keep calling her fucking name. But she does not have a high rear. She's got the straightest back ever. And she's growing up to be a real pretty dog. That head is getting nice. And she's a little timid. I ain't even gonna lie. So this is one of the reasons. See, you gotta know your dog. You can't take your dog around people if you know your dog. This dog right here, she got like about another two or three months to show me if she's gonna be a, a people person dog. If not, then I'll just keep her away from people. It's just that simple. Then I'll just keep her away from people. I don't have to chain her up. I don't like a dog that's chained up. I want my dog to be free. I like to see a dog run. Throw the ball at that motherfucker and let him take off and run. I like that. Maybe he might want to chase a bird or a rabbit or something. I like that too. I just don't like to see a dog that sits there looking in the outer space. <clears throat> and he's not really finding nothing. You know, he's just looking in the outer space. Probably his, his tongue is hanging out his mouth and the dog won't even wag his tail. That right there is something I really don't. That's not. I'm not a fan of none of that shit right there, for real. If the dog won't even wag his tail and he just look in the outer space all day long, fuck that. No, nah, hell no. Nah. Hell no. Nah. I'm going to think that motherfucker was doing something crazy, bright eyes. Yes, yeah, sir. I'm going to think that the dog was doing something crazy. The dog probably might have been fucking with my weed, man. You might have been in my greens. Were you in my greens, little dog? Hey, man, I got some nice size buds up on my, um, what kind of plant was that I grew? Uh, black gushers. I had got some, some nice size buds out of my black gushers. Big ass, big ass donkey dick buds. But this right here. This was some blue zittles. It's some stanky too. This shit stink. Fuck it stink. It stink like a bitch. And guess what? I grew it with no nutrients. There was a few plants that I grew. I grew with no nutrients. You know what I'm saying? It was just lovely like that. I knew I could do it. You know what I'm saying? A lot of things I do. You know what I'm saying? Just because... uh. I just like the, the artist shit, you know what I mean? Like <laughs> like the thriller shit, man, you know what I'm saying? I just, 
like to get it in and if I could do it, I could do it. You know what I mean? And I, and then on top of that, a lot of people smoking weed, man. That got so many chemicals in that shit. It got chemicals in it. You know what I mean? So when you when you smoke your own pot, man, you know what I mean? You know for a fact you ain't smoking no no bullshit. You know what I mean? You you smoking dope. You know what I mean? Up here in California, everybody got weed, but damn near not all of it is is dope. You know what I mean? You want the, you want that shit to be dope. That shit got to be dope, you know what I mean? And when you come around, you see some good, man, go for it. Get the good, man. Get the good. We don't do too much promoting marijuana on Face the Bully, but marijuana is one of the things that I like to grow besides fruits and vegetables. <clears throat> I do grow a lot. <clears throat> you know what I mean? Uh... I don't give a fuck, man. You know what I'm saying? One thing about it is I didn't I ain't never been to your motherfucking dispensary, man. You know what I'm saying? Fuck your dispensary, dog. You know what I mean? I ain't going to that motherfucker, man. You know what I mean? As long as they got uh, uh, seeds available. Alright? As long as they got seeds available, you see those? Those are pot seeds. A whole jar of them. And I got more than that. But as long as they got seeds available, you can shut that bitch ass club down. I'll never go to it. I never go to that motherfucker. Y'all finding all kinds of shit in y'all cannabis clubs. Fentanyl. Y'all finding fentanyl on the weed. Crack on the weed. <laughs> Crystal meth on the weed. You got a cannabis dispensary and you finding drugs on your weed. What the fuck, my nigga? And you want me to come to that shit? Fuck that. Hell no, I ain't coming to that shit, nigga. I pull out jars of my own shit. You know what I'm saying? I don't... I ain't going to your motherfucking dispensary. Not me. Nah, fuck that. They got dispensaries and shit they be going to. People getting all fucked up. You know what I'm saying? Off of shit. You know what I mean? You need to be having real... Y'all need your own fucking gardens, man. <clears throat> when you grow your own pot, man. You know what I'm saying? And you pull out your own jars of shit, man. You know what I'm saying? They everywhere. You know what I'm saying? They just be everywhere. Jars of pot, dogs, and all kinds of shit. You know what I mean? Just everywhere, bro. Fast the bully. You know what I'm saying? And you don't go to no dispensary. You know what I'm saying? This is a worldwide shutdown of your motherfucking dispensary. Nigga, fuck your dispensary, nigga. Why you care about that motherfucking dispensary? Fuck that dispensary. Y'all must have thought up here in Cali we like dispensary. Fuck no. I bought, Do you know if we went to a dispensary and got a bud that size, a motherfucker would try to charge you an arm and a leg just for that bud. Try to charge you an arm and a leg, bro. You know what I'm saying? You go up in the weed shop out here, you got this much weed right here. Cannabis. You go up in the cannabis store, and that's some good too. Why you bullshitting? That's some flavorful right there. That's some flavorful. Face the bully. Oh, yeah. What did I say that shit was called? Blue Zittles? Yeah, that shit was called Blue Zittles. No, this, yeah, yeah, this was Blue Zittles. And I had another one called Black Gushers. I didn't do a lot of trimming, man. You know what I mean? I ain't had time for it right now. But, yeah, man, fuck that dispensary, man. We ain't going to that shit. You finding dope in your motherfucking weed? How you get dope in your weed, man? I want to know that shit off gas. How the fuck y'all find the fentanyl in y'all fucking weed? I ain't never go. <laughs> I ain't never going to no cannabis dispensary, man. This is a dog show, man. I'm probably talking my dog. I'm just fucking around, man. You know what I mean? When you at the house by yourself. Sometimes you ain't really got to kick no knowledge and you got all this knowledge. We, I got knowledge, trust me. But right now, I'm just fucking with it, man. You know what I'm saying? Just fucking with it, man. Watching my dog sleep. You know what I mean? Sipping on some motherfucking shit in this here styrofoam cup right here, man. You know what I mean? Sipping on some shit. I you know. <laughs> I, I'm, I'm just sitting back enjoying my motherfucking quiet time. Because at my house, it don't happen like that too much. Uh, it don't happen like that too much. 
me and Bright Eyes always got to get it in with something. You know what I'm saying? She got some little kid hanging off her right ear. You know what I'm saying? She got a little kid hanging off her right ear. She be... Bright, <laughs> Bright Eyes did snap at a little kid the other day, though. Little kid was pulling the shit out of her ear. Just kept yanking the fuck out of her ear. I was like, get your baby. See? And I'm telling y'all about shit, man. You know what I mean? Real nigga shit, bruh. Because a dog don't just, just haul off and bite no motherfucking body. Y'all got them crazy ass dogs that they doing shit like that. Just fucking biting people and shit. What the fuck, man? You know what I'm saying? Then you want to say, the American bully is a killer. Man, this dog right here is a pot dog. That motherfucker ain't so much weed till it's pathetic. I ain't put that on the camera. You know what I'm saying? I'm just saying. She, she ain't even never in her right mind. And she ain't, she ain't never biting nobody. I don't, I don't believe a lot of shit you people be saying no more, man. When it come to dogs, man. Quit, quit making a negative name on an American bully. Quit getting an American bully a bad name. You know what I'm saying? Don't be doing that shit. Don't be doing that shit there. Because, uh, you know, an American bully is actually a good dog. Look at it. It's sleeping. <laughs> that bitch knocked out. <laughs> hey, man. I'm finna go recharge. And I'll be back right here on Fast Up Bugs.